All right, so decided to venture out to try something local, recommended by locals. It's called Vivian's Kitchen, and um, no one here, but uh, gonna show you around a bit. Let's start with this really cute pooch. Hey, he's just been here the entire time. But let me show you around the restaurant. It's pretty much like in someone's house. There's the entrance, so you can like sit here. And here's the menu. So they have today's special, which is up here. And then there's these that are done to order. So I got the stew chicken, which I think I got options of rice and beans or white rice. And if you look up here is where we go to order. If you come here, and it's like someone's house, like I said. So I'm sure they're living back there and they're cooking like back there somewhere. Pretty interesting, and I'm kind of excited to see how the food turns out. We'll see, I guess. Oh, there comes the food. Mm. All right, I'm excited to try this new chicken. Let's see how it tastes. <laughs> Interesting. I guess it's Caribbean food, but to me it tastes more like Cuban or even like Mexican food. It's seasoned, um, not too salty or heavy. It's quite a light flavor. It's really good. It's very homemade. So this is the plantain, um, which I love, so it was really good. I kind of like to mix my food between salty and sweet, but they both exist on my plate. I like to take a bite of the salty, the sweet, and the salty. So actually this is really nice to have um, kind of a home-cooked dinner. Sometimes it's hard to find a place like this local when you go to any country, but um, yeah. Really enjoying this. Rice is always one of those, you know, um, comfort food for me. So I have to say, I had a really good experience here. I will have to give Vivian's Kitchen a four and a half thumbs up. I definitely love to come back and try more of their dishes. And I do recommend that you guys come here too when you come to Cayman Island. Or actually, this is the Grand Cayman.